All right, we are back, we are back. Let's jump right back into this and start the Deku playthrough. So interesting thing about this first attempt, we don't have our ocarina, we don't have a sword. We're stuck as a Deku the entire time. We have three days to go get our ocarina back. There's some stuff that I know how to do already, but I'm gonna play this like I don't. Like, I could skip a whole section, but where's the fun in that? Boom, boom. Nope, leave me alone! Okay. Hey, buddy. All right, we need to go this way and not get attacked by the dog! We can go set up our bank account real quick. So the bank account's pretty important in this game. Um, it'll follow you through the whole game. So if we set this up with him now... So we're gonna literally just deposit three. Just so he'll hold on to it. This is so we can get our stuff back through different playthroughs. Pretty much every time we see him from now on, he'll update that stamp with how much we have. All right. Nothing to do here. We have a lot of time to burn. And that's why I'm kind of just playing around right now. Like, in all honesty, we have way more time than we need on the first, uh... The first cycle, <laughs> I don't need 72 hours. I'm trying to slow down, but... You just don't need 72 hours. Oh, hold on. We'll play this. Yeah, okay. We're we're going to go see the Great Fairy. Oh no. What happened? Okie doke. So now we gotta find the stray lost fairy. So... We'll explore a little bit. There's games here. Clock Town's fun. Some people don't like Clock Town. They think it's boring. This is what I was talking about. Right here, we could put the code in and go straight in there and skip, really, the first half of this story. But we're not gonna do that. If we came here at night, this is where the Great Fairy Strafe would be. But we're not here at night, we're here at day. Gotta juke the dog. So earlier when I started to go up this way, that's why I stopped myself. This is where the stray is. You can find it early and collect it early, but um... Yeah, you can't stop in water as the Deku either. You'll jump across it. And then your last jump actually is a big jump. 
If you don't make it out of the water by that point, you sink. Good single. It's so cute! A great fairy. Got it. Okay. Okie doke. Let's go this way. All right, so now we have magic powers. Oh, inverted controls. Oh, shenanigans. That's a miss. There it is. Me, I did it. So yeah, we know the code already, but we'll play it right. I have to find them by the morning. Oh my gosh, I forgot how awful these controls were. Where to go? Sit down. We got three to go and it's two o'clock, we're fine. Tattle, we're fine. Oh yeah, it's a game. I don't have the money to play. No money. So, if you're trying to play this game and beat it up 100%, this is actually a pretty big uh, storyline for you. Because this is what will give you your record book, essentially, of what needs to be done still. Because there's a bunch of masks to collect, and this actually helps with that. Oh yeah, this kid. Oh no! Oh, don't attack cuckoos. Oh! That's bad. Do not attack cuckoos. Yeah, yeah, growl, growl, snarl, snarl. 
Oh, I can't remember where the other two are. Oh, one's up there, yeah. I think the last one's in the uh, east, so whatever it is, the Oath Banker. Don't you dare! Uh, I was gonna say, that's not fair, because we're not allowed to leave. Alright, last one, we'll go across. Well, first night. It goes quick. It goes quick. Now, the good thing is we want to be at the observatory at night, so we are fine pacing-wise. No problems there. There's the last one. Da -na -na -na. Oh yeah, I have to do this later. Three, two, five, four, one. Three, two, five, four, one. Three, two, five, four, one. All right, we gotta get through the uh, bomber section pretty quickly. See, this is where things get iffy. After this, we kinda don't have as much to do. Oh. Yeah, there. <laughs> the code's the same. You could just go through. But we're not doing all that.